The Sahara is the largest desert on the planet, almost as big as the United States, with the highest recorded temperature in the world, 136 degrees Fahrenheit. Adam and the men of the caravan will walk from their home village of Timia in Niger to the oasis town of Bilma in search of a prize once said to be as valuable as gold. Then they will travel to the markets in the south before they see home again, a journey of some 1,500 miles. Nothing can be left to chance on a journey like this. The camels are the men's lifeline. The fresh growth after the rains provide grasses rich in mineral salts. Everything that 15 men, one boy, and 150 camels need for the journey to Bilma must be carried from here. Adam is young to be heading out with the caravan, but he will be expected to pull his weight. He has a secret ally. Privately, Uncle Ibushi wonders if Adam is ready. Tomorrow, the caravan leaves. The men have to work through the night to finish preparing. Their schedule is already very tight. For the next six months, Adam won't have time to study the Quran. He'll be too busy learning essential skills, like using the stars to navigate. Adam's guide to the heavens will be the caravan's guide, Ibrahim Aliman. <laughs> The men may be ready, but their transportation isn't. The younger camels are nervous, but it's the older ones who behave really badly. They know what lies ahead. Ibushi gives any camel not on peak form a pick-me-up, a snort of tobacco. It takes four strong men to lift the load each camel has to carry. This is going to be hard work for Adam. But his uncle is right behind him.
करते हैं Everyone comes together for final prayers. This trip could make or break them. Last year's caravan was a disaster. Another bad year, and the business could fold forever. <laughs> 